Welcome back. A warning before next story. While it is only a demonstration, some of you might find some of the images disturbing. Now, News for Utah's Sarah Martin spent the morning with UVU's forensic students practicing crime scene investigations. And also, just so you know, no pigs or humans were harmed making this story. These little piggies are stillborn. They come from a research company, but here in this class, they get a little bit of a second life, teaching these students how to solve crime. Amy Houghton is the director of the Forensic Investigation Emphasis. She spent 11 years in forensics for NCIS all over the world. In the past year, she's buried cadaver pigs in this field for students to find and investigate. The important thing is, is when you're digging a grave from the very uh, beginning, it's an intrusive act, and you're destroying your scene the second you put a shovel in the ground. So right now we're just really lightly taking out dirt and trying to get the walls of the grave. This dirt, the soil that we're putting here, we're going to be sifting it to make sure we don't lose any little fragments or evidence of anything. She's also placed a pig above ground for insect practice. There you go. Ooh, perfect. Insects tell us a lot of information about how long has it been since an individual has been deceased? I personally love solving, you know, trying to figure out who did it, what what happened. Jacqueline Alvarez is a senior. She said it was the show Forensic Files that led her to this career choice. I could see it on TV and I'd be like, oh, you know, I'm fine with that. But then to actually see it in person and smell, you know, dead bodies and stuff, I wanted to see how I would react to it. And yeah, I, I, could, I toughed it out and... You just kind of turn off your emotions and leave it at the door and then just focus on the crime. Each of these young women told me that the work is fascinating and hopefully rewarding. You can find out more about UVU Forensics on our website at goodforutah.com. Reporting in Lehigh, I'm Sarah Martin, ABC4 News. Our 